see a lot of younger patients with sports injuries and those patients with degenerative knees and arthritis tend to be the younger patients and that's a very very difficult cohort of patients to treat with osteoarthritis. So the young patient uh, with a severely arthritic knee whose knee is, is too far gone for a biological reconstruction um, but who's in so much pain they need a knee replacement at an age where normally one might be a little bit uncomfortable doing a standard knee. What Conformis has allowed is that it's given me a greater, a wider comfort zone so I feel more comfortable doing artificial knees in younger patients. And what's terribly important to me with the conformist knees is they allow the complete range of options. We can do a medial uni for just medial osteoarthritis. And what's really important is now for the first time we've got a really decent option for a lateral um, uni. And then if the patient's got medial and patellofemoral or lateral and patellofemoral, then we can do two compartments. And that's a very novel approach. And if the patient has three compartments, then we can do the full eye total. So we've got the complete range. And what this allows us to do is to do the most conservative option for the patient, depending on how bad their disease is. One of the deciding factors in choosing to move over to the conformist knee was patient reported outcomes. What I'm finding is the patients are much happier than they tend to be with a normal standard knee. The conformist knee fits not just the size but also the shape and the contours of the patient's own knee so it feels more like a normal knee. So we're seeing better patient outcomes in terms of satisfaction of function. The most obvious one is that patient specific jigs fit perfectly. The jigs allow you to get the alignment right, the cuts perfect, the positioning perfect and that's deeply reassuring. In terms of the bone that's resected, the, the, the bone cuts are very, very conservative. So you end up taking away just thin slivers of bone um, compared to a normal knee replacement where you take away quite, quite decent thick wedges of bone. And I think for me personally, the real stark contrast was going from an eye total back to a traditional bog standard knee replacement. And only then did I appreciate how horrible it was doing the traditional knee replacement, which was much more archaic, medieval in its instrumentation, um, shocking in how much bone I took away. So it was only then that I really got a firm grasp for just how good the eye total is and how good the eye uni are. First of all, I explained that with a standard knee, they come in different sizes. Different sizes, but all the same shape. So there's a size A, B, C, D, E, but the problem with knees is that the geometry of a knee is very complex. So each individual not only has a different size knee, but a very different shapes, so different contours. So if you have a standard knee, then it's going to hopefully match closely, maybe not exactly, but closely the size of your own knee. It won't match the exact contours, then it's, therefore it's unlikely to feel exactly like your own knee. If you want a knee that matches the size, the shape, the contours of your knee, then you're going to have to have it patient specific. It's going to be tailored to the exact size, shape and contours of your knee and only the conformist knee does that. So once I explain to people the differences between the conformist knee and a bog standard knee, then most patients say straight away they want the best knee. They know this knee is hopefully going to be in there for 10, 20, 30 plus years. So they want the best knee for them, which is the sensible way forward. Conformist represents a massive leap forward. It's, it's a sea change in the way that we approach knee replacements. It's a revolutionary improvement. Um, it's leaps and bounds ab above any other knee replacement that's out there. And my patients, the patients that I see in my practice, um, they're very high demand and they, they expect the best. And the conformist knee is the best. It is significantly better than any other prosthesis I've ever encountered. And so I have moved over to the conformist knee as, as I want to provide the best possible care for my patients and conformist allows me to do that.